Good day again everybody, after the last video on my Artemia project last May 23rd. I finally decided that it was a failure. But I have something very important in this final episode. So let's watch the video. On 25th of May, there is no life at all in the tank. So I add another batch of eggs. But the same happen after 6 days. All of Norpilia are melting one by one. So I try to search for another source about our team online, and I stumble with Diana Wallstad's article. Also a video from Emmanuel Bakundukais. As Emmanuel stated, 20 ppt is the best salinity for growing our team here. So I restarted my culture. This time I just use 2 scoop or 2 tablespoon of rock salt in 1 liter of water, it gives me around 20 to 21 ppt. By the way, just a correction to my previous videos. ppt stands for parts per thousand and not parts per trillion, thank you for the correction NJ. Finally, the method seemed to work flawlessly, I follow what Diana said about using old water from fully cycled aquarium and the salinity of 20 ppt as Emmanuel said. I restarted this culture on May 30th. I didn't remove the algae from the tank. Only I replaced the water. And they are growing very well. Because I just using a stock tap water before. I think Artemia is so sensitive to heavy metals from tap water. So maybe a water conditioner will work. But old water from my tank works fine. And free from my water changes. I have another culture in a small jar. Same time when I restarted this tank. I use the extra water with the same salinity. And they grow fine without problem as well. So it means they can leave even in a small container as long as the condition is right. Assuming that this method now will work 100%. I set up two of 2.5 gallon tank with a small sponge filter. Also I add some dirt and sand from my aquarium. And I use a plant grow light to help the growth of algae. They are 4 days old in this video. I can see the difference with this lower salinity and old tank water. The baby brine shrimp move so fast and grow every day. So, this is the setup that works for me right now. And I'm happy to share it with you as well. If you want to grow Artemia for fish food or whatever, just remember this three most important thing. Number one. Water from cycled aquarium or conditioned tap water. Number two. Salinity of 20 ppt. Number three. Spirulina powder for food. And that's it. Hope you will succeed as well. Brine shrimp is so fascinating animal. Some call it sea monkeys, sea dragons, etc. Once again, thank you for watching lovely people, I will just update once in a while about my Artemia, and also my next EcoCube project. Take care.